Our high school football game of the week is set and it's a good one. Number four Nagani visits number three Kingsford Friday night in a battle of two unbeaten teams. Here's a look ahead. The Miners are 3-0 thanks to a pair of three touchdown wins, followed by a 29-0 victory to spoil Calumet's homecoming last Friday. The Flivers are 3-0 after taking care of business against Escanaba and Houghton at home before going on the road and shutting out Gladstone in week three. There's a lot of mutual respect between these two formidable teams. Kingsford's a very good football team. A lot of tradition, a lot of history. Um, you know, tremendous lot of respect between the two clubs. But we got to be good. You know, we got to be better than them. And you do that by, by taking care of the ball and, and making the most of your opportunities. They're up front, right? They're, that's, that's what you look at right away and say, these guys are pretty good. And so how do we handle that up front and what do we do? And, you know, and we're, we're a little bit young up front, but we've, you know, we actually probably played our best game last week, watching our young guys grow and develop. We're really excited about where they're going. It's no secret that both Nagani and Kingsford excel at the line of scrimmage, especially defensively. They've combined to allow just 22 points through three weeks of this season. It's also no secret that both teams like to utilize their strong offensive lines and keep the ball on the ground. You know, we run the ball well. It's Nagani football. That's what we like to do. We run hard. We work hard. We able to throw in a few plays. We got a good quarterback. Got some good athletes. Nagani squeaked out a 13-12 win when these teams met at Miner Stadium last season. Expect another slugfest this time around. I mostly remember that that was my hardest game ever last year. I mean, that game beat me up, and I'm excited this year. They've been coming off a few great years. They've, they've had a great team for a while now, and obviously lost a tough one last year, so we're looking to get back at them this year. Friday night's matchup will kick off at 6 o'clock local time at Fliver Field.